take a look at this fascinating visual. It shows an eclipse, a rare but beautiful phenomenon. Let us find out what an eclipse is and how it occurs. All planets, including the Earth, revolve around the Sun in a fixed orbit. Also, the Moon revolves around the Earth. Furthermore, you may know that light travels in a straight line. So, sunlight falls on all planets in a straight line. At times, the Moon, Sun and Earth come into a straight line. This is when an eclipse occurs. There are two types of eclipses, lunar and solar. Let us learn about each in detail. A lunar eclipse occurs when the Earth comes in between the Sun and the Moon. In a lunar eclipse, the Earth blocks some of the sunlight that would normally reach the Moon and the Earth's shadow falls on the Moon's surface. The shadow has two parts. The dark inner part of the shadow is called umbra and the faint outer shadow around umbra is called penumbra. Total lunar eclipse occurs when Moon passes through the umbral shadow of the Earth. A partial lunar eclipse occurs when only a portion of the Moon enters the umbra. A lunar eclipse occurs only at full Moon when the Moon is directly opposite to the Sun. You can watch it with your naked eyes. During a total lunar eclipse, the Moon appears red. This is because red component of sunlight can filter through the Earth's atmosphere to reach the Moon. The filtered sunlight makes the Moon appear red during a total lunar eclipse. Let us now find out how a solar eclipse occurs. A solar eclipse occurs at new moon when the Sun, Moon and Earth come in a straight line with the Moon in the middle. The Moon obstructs the path of sunlight and so the shadow of the Moon falls on the Earth. Total solar eclipse occurs in the region where the umbral shadow of the Moon falls on the Earth. Those in this region on the Earth cannot see the Sun and to them the sky appears dark. When the Moon's penumbral shadow strikes the Earth, we see a partial solar eclipse in that region. During a solar eclipse, the Moon partially or fully covers the Sun as viewed from a location on the Earth. During a total solar eclipse, all one can see from the Earth is a ring of light around the Moon. This thin circle of light is visible because that is the only part of the Sun that the Moon did not cover. It is dangerous to look at a solar eclipse directly using sunglasses or binoculars. The best way to watch it is through a pinhole projector.